Arrows fans, Jock O'Connell here with a special edition of the RAA News Update. Now the club is happy to announce of the re-signing of Patrick Dangerfield. We caught up with him earlier after his announcement. Well, Paddy, I'm not sure if you're aware, but there's been a little bit of speculation <laughs> over your contract. How tough was the decision in the end? Uh, it wasn't tough. It was, it's nice to have it uh, out of the way. Um, uh, like I said, it wasn't tough to do. It was, it's nice to have it out of the way now, and now we can just focus on... Um, winning games of footy and I can just focus on winning games of footy rather than the speculation that surrounded uh, obviously the contract. What are some of the things that you had to factor into your decision to stay? Um, obviously team success is a huge one. Uh, the, re the relationship you have with your coach which I think is a, a real positive for us with, with Sando here at the club. Um, and obviously family uh, back home uh, compared to uh, living over here away from them but once I uh, sorted all that out, it was, it was a pretty straightforward decision because I, I think uh, the future we've got here at the club's pretty bright. You mentioned the future of the club just then. How far do you think this group can go? Where do you see it going in the next few years? Yeah, I think that we've got a huge future ahead of us. Um, certainly the, the start we've had to the season has been really good and I think going forward we're only going to be a better side um, the more we adjust to Sando's game style and the more we adjust to... I suppose there's been different players playing different positions this year, so the more we get to know each other's games, we're going to be a lot better side for it. And uh, I, I think we've, we'll be a successful side this year, not only obviously in the first half of the season, but in the second half as well. And personally, you've had a good start to the season as well. How much have you grown into that leadership role and enjoying the midfield role this season? Yeah, I've loved playing in the midfield, obviously, um, which I haven't done a huge amount. But I, I think also it's been good to play in the midfield. But having said that, I don't think I can underestimate the work that. I did last year under Craigie in the forward line. I think that's made me become a better midfielder. So I think that almost the start to my career has been a good way to help me become a better midfielder with the work that Craigie did. But I think the even contribution we've got at the moment in the midfield has been really good for us. And if we can keep the even spread, then we'll be a good side. You touched on your relationship with Sando. What was his reaction when you told him, I'm staying around? Uh, like he does most of the time, he's had a nice big smile on his face. So. Uh, it's good to it's good to get mine out of the way and now we can focus on obviously getting the other boys very signed and, and focus on playing footy rather than players' contracts. Fantastic news there with Paddy Dangerfield deciding to stay at the Crows. Well stay tuned to afc.com.au for more news later in the week. At least. <laughs> right. yeah. This has been the Crows News Update brought to you by RAA, insurance you can trust.